Hey guys, it's me and Lamb Goat. Mopsy! <laughs> and the little pink princess dragon. Hello, everybody. How are you today? We got some big boxy news. Boxy. Ooh, here we do. <clears throat> we got some boxy news. We, um, you know, pop up was Monday and it's going to continue and they're going to be putting up new stuff every day for I don't know how long, but I know even on Monday, I went back in and there was new stuff up already. So, <clears throat> you know, make your choices for your premium and your you know, whatever boxes you're getting, base box, unless you're getting Lux, Lux box, whatever. But check out the pop up because there's some really good deals in there. I am going to try really hard not to look in there anymore because I got something going on, on Friday. Um, I, I got some things for, you know, giveaway and I got some things for myself. And, you know, it's, um, you know, when that comes, we'll definitely, you know, look into it and put her up here. So, until then, you guys go take a seat. So, yeah, um, you know, I knew there was going to be some pretty good deals. Like, there are some palettes that you can get for like $3. I decided <clears throat> that I was going to go in there and I was not going to get the cheap stuff. Um, I wasn't going to get anything that wasn't a brand that I'm not already very familiar with. So, uh, I got some Marc Jacobs. Um, I got some Vice Art. Um, I got a Smashbox setting spray. Blah, 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 blah. Um, I, I got a few things. Ooh, the Bum Bum. You know, the Bum Bum. The Sol de Janeiro, they were already out of the conditioner by the time I got in there. But they still had the shampoo. It was like, I don't know, $9 for the shampoo. And, um, well, I would like to have the shampoo and the conditioner. Like, you know what? And BoxyCharm is sold out to Ipsy. Who knows how this stuff is going to... Oh, no, it's not going to be any changes. That's BS. Okay, there's going to be changes. And so I'm going to get the stuff that I like now because, you know, you might be able to get it later on. You might be able to get a better deal on it later on. Or you might not be able to get it at all later on. So, you know, um, I, I went in there. Guns... Guns are flying. Got me some stuff now. <laughs> so, uh, speaking of Marc Jacobs, let's put on some Marc Jacobs, shall we? I have no idea what I'm going to do. Like, except that I'm going to use this palette that sometimes doesn't want to open. It has a gorgeous mirror. Look at this. This is your little plastic sheet, that your protector sheet. I'm sorry. That is a cool sheet. And if you want to cover up your mirror, it does a really good job, too. So, yeah, look at all that lusciously goodness. I have no idea what I'm going to do. This right here is a gorgeous topper. I don't know. I don't know. I guess first, maybe I should put on some Marc Jacobs eyeshadow primer hello because you know sometimes it'd be like that so where is my actual 10 times multiplication mirror yeah because you know you get old you get blind that's life <laughs> and yeah i did just have my eyes done so I shouldn't say that because I'm not like really blind anymore, but it still, it still helps when you're doing, you know, intricate things, like especially when you're messing with your eyes that you have, you 
something you can really see clearly in. Oh, you know what else I got? It was like at the very top when I went in there. It was nine dollars. And uh you know the funny thing is if it was nine dollars in the store I probably wouldn't get it. But since I already have money put away to do the pop up, I went you know, I go ahead and and spend that money. Um I got I forget what the brand is. But I got a set of those magnetic lashes. So we're gonna find out what that's all about. <laughs> um all right, we are Ooh, yeah, I went to Starbucks. Because we have a, a Starbucks just went up in our little conglomeration of stores out here in the middle of nowhere. And, uh, I could not get on the Wi-Fi. Now, the last time I was in there, I used the Wi-Fi no problem. But this time, there was quite a few people with laptops. So, I'm wondering if maybe they were just pulling all the signal and, you know, the phone just wasn't going to do it. I don't know. You know, I have, I do not have endless amounts of money, and my phone really needs a new battery. Um, you know, it, it says crazy stuff now that I know this, it, what it means is I need a new battery and I'll stop all this. <laughs> all right, Mark Jacobs, we are going to use this one right here for... I'm just going to set this right in there. I don't know. I may end up putting it down, but for now, that'll work. But yeah, I, I couldn't get online. I like, I could get notifications, but I couldn't even, like, check out the notifications. I Like, it was, like, nothing. So, I ended up, because... Where I work at is actually closer, like halfway between me and the Starbucks. Yeah, I am going to set that down. So, um, I ended up going to work, using the Wi-Fi there. Um, yeah, hello, it works fine. Sometimes it'd be like that. When I do that, I'm like checking the, the time up in the corner. <laughs> See, how much time do I actually have left? Okay, what are we going to do? Oh, mmm, boom ya. Hmm. Let's go with, got some really pretty greens going on here. Um. So, I think I'm going to put this kind of dark green in my crease, or just above the crease. But, I know it looks really dark now, but I'm going to get the excess off of here. And then we're going to blend. So, it won't be quite so dark. You know, here's something else that I have learned from really using my palettes and just wearing makeup every day, whether I'm going out somewhere or not, is first off, what it looks like in the pan may or may not be what it's going to look like when you put it on and if you're going to blend unless you're willing to build i mean as you blend it's going to thin out so it's not going to you know look as which is why you want pigment because if you only have pigment and you put it on and you start blending you're going to blend down to nothing so you definitely you must have some pigment It's really warm in here. I'm going to turn on the fan. Whew, I know y'all going to be hearing that, but you know, that's 
how it is. Ooh, so, there we go. All right, now we've got a kind of a yellow green shimmery thing going on right here. And I'm going to use that like right below the brow. Ooh. Ooh, that's pretty. Oh, yeah. And then we're going to blend that into the crease. Or, you know, the color that we just used for the crease. Whatever. Y'all know what I'm talking about. You know. You know. Ooh. So pretty. So. Definitely, even though today is Tuesday, if you have not been into the pop-up yet, go check it out because there is some fun stuff in there. What I get? I got the magnetic lashes. I got, I don't know, two or three Marc Jacobs palettes because, you know, um, I figure I'll use some for giveaway, right? I tried really hard to get, I had the Natasha Denona, I had a palette, and I had, I had the, the eyeshadow palette, and I had the face palette in my basket, and, or cart, whatever. By the time I got to pay out, and I should have known Natasha Denona was going to go quick, it's, you know, by the time I went to pay out, it was already sold out, and I should have just... I should have went and got those first and, and you know, paid for them and then went back in. But no, you Venus that I am. <sighs> okay, so now we need something for the outside corner. And I think what I'm going to do, I'm going to go back to that first dark green that I put in the crease. And... Just put it right here on the outside corner. Try to get it between my wrinkles because, you know, we got the whole wrinkle thing going on here. Yeah, I could have, you know, four eyes for the amount of skin I got here. Like hoods, hoods, hoods. Yep, yep, yep. Okay. I am going to blend that, but I'm really just going to blend the edges because I don't want to lose the, the kind of a difference there. You can see how that looks a little bit different. Or, you know, maybe not. I don't know. So Friday. Friday the 13th. Mm-hmm. Um... Gotta be way to do this, right? Jeffree Star is launching a new palette. It's called Blood Money, and it is a green palette. See, I'm just gonna kind of lay it on, which sometimes is called packing. But yeah, I'm just gonna kind of lay it on there and not, not try to wipe it on so much. Whew. So, um, I saw the YouTube and, like, I'm generally not drawn to greens a lot. Therefore, I do not have a lot of green. Um, I did get the e.l.f. bite size. And I was amazed at how much I liked it. I don't know. Sometimes when you, you don't do something and then you try it and you're like, it's it's different, so you like it. I don't know. I don't know. Don't know the reason. All I know is I really kind of, all of a sudden, I'm like, kind of feeling the greens a little bit. So, I think it's 10 o'clock California time. Was that Pacific? Um, which is one o'clock in the afternoon on 
Florida time, Eastern, um, I am going to try to get in on that first launch. And you know, Becca from Becca's Beauty Journey, which is right there, only it used to be channel, but now it's Journey, but I already had that made up, so blah, 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 blah. Um, I'm going to go with this other kind of green right here. And we're going to put that in the lid. Actually, hmm, yeah, I am. <laughs> like, I'm, I'm trying to change horses midstream here. That's what that looks like. It's kind of a green gold thing going on. Ooh, ooh, that is so pretty. But, um, this palette is, I think there's one gold, and pretty much everything else in there is green. Where, you know, I noticed with a few of his palettes, you know, like the purple palette has got a lot of stuff in there that's not purple. And the blue palette has got, <clears throat> like, a lot of neutrals in it, you know. But I think most people these days, wow, what do you guys think? Ooh. Um... You know, I used to be really about, I want to pull out one palette and just use that one palette. But I think if you want to mix a neutral with a green, you're going to be able to pull out a neutral palette. And I know from the Jawbreaker, which, you know, it's the only one of his that I have. But his, his makeup does seem to play nicely with others. See what we got going here. So, uh, wow, that is, that is really pretty, I think. What do you guys think? <laughs> you know if that'll even focus. Maybe if I do like this. Wah, wah. <laughs> Okay, so, what did I do with the, mm hmm, hmm, all right, um, I do believe I'm going to, go back with that darker matte green, and just kind of like pull it under the eye just a wee bit. Like I probably might have to get. Oh, I got a purple eye uh, mascara too. I don't really know <laughs> what brand it was. I can't remember. But, uh. I was like, okay, you don't see that real often, so yeah, I'm going to go for it. Ooh, ooh, so pretty. Okay, so, I'm going to go with the one that I used, the really light one that I used up here. I'm going to put that right on the... Not the spot, the dot, but kind of on my inside corner. It's really... Doesn't look that different when you put them side by side. But it is definitely, I think, lighter than the other. <sighs> wow. And... Now we're going to go with the, the silver and you spot the dot. So it's just this little, little dot area right there. I usually do like a silver in there. Um, sometimes I'll use like maybe just a highlighter or 
gold or something, you know, maybe a pink, something sparkly, depending upon what else I have going on. But, um, so that's what I'm using out of there. I can't believe I didn't use that topper because I almost use, I use that topper almost every time I dig this one out. Mmm. Oh, she's so pretty. Pretty, pretty, pretty. Okay, I think... For eyeliner, let's go with the yellow and see. Oh, I think that looks good. Kind of brightens it up a little bit. These are LA Girl. Um, these are really good. Like. I get them right at the CVS. I don't even have to order them online. They're just right there. They're like maybe $3.99 a piece. And usually I've got some kind of coupon. Like the last one I got. This one here. I had so many coupons when I finally got the purple one. That the guy was like, um, yeah, 50 cents. 50 cents. And I was like, oh, I owe you 50 cents. That's cool. And he said, no, we owe you 50 cents. So I got that puppy for free, you know, and we had a laugh because, no, they, they're not going to give you the 50 cents. But we did get a good laugh out of it because, you know, it actually came up being, I could have gotten something else and had, you know, 50 cents taken off of it, what have you. All right, I am going to put on some mascara and I'll be right back. Ooh, I hope I hit the right button. All right, so guys, here we are, the finished look. Also, I want to mention, I got a card from <clears throat> Gracie Lou Bargain Guru. She has a channel. You guys get a chance. Go check her out. Um, she does a, a lot of, uh, like, a lot of real life stuff and a lot of openings and, you know, kind of a variety and, you know, bargains. Bargain guru that kind of makes you think she's probably can tell you where to get stuff at a bargain, too. <laughs> but she sent us this card. A little Halloween wish. And look at the kitty. Is that cute? I love a calico. I'm not a cat person, but I love the whole calico thing. I just think calico cats are so cute. <clears throat> Hope you get your fill. Of all the Halloween brings, of all the Halloween brings, bleh, when your night is over and you go to sleep wishing you the sweetest dreams. That's so cute. And then she actually wrote a message. Hello, Sue. How are you, my friend? Doing all right, Gracie Lou. How about you? I know we don't talk much, but I just love watching your videos when I can. Girl, I know the feeling. Trying to, like, put up videos and go watch everybody else's videos is, like, ridiculous crazy time consuming you know and hold down you know a 50 plus hour a week job and get anything done at the house girl i totally understand but i do try all my people <clears throat> in my little community i put on my watch later and then even if i don't get a chance to actually watch them i'll like do a playlist while i'm putting on makeup or something make sure i hit the like button <clears throat> and leave, even if I just leave some icons, you know, something in the comment section. I just, it's important to support the people that you like so that they can continue to, you know, this is a lot of work doing these videos. You might think we just sit down here and, you know, you got to have everything where you can reach it. Um, planning, there, there's a lot to making these videos, so... You know, if you appreciate people, make sure you hit that like button and leave a comment. It is so important. So important. You just, you know, and subscribe, obviously. <laughs> uh, okay, girl. Um, You know, support your people. That's what I'm saying. Support. I only hope we can become better friends or great friends. Wish you a happy Halloween, my friend. XOXO. 
Gracie Liu Bargain Guru. Thank you, Gracie. That was like so incredibly sweet of you. And I hope that you had a great Halloween and <clears throat> didn't eat too much pumpkin pie. <laughs> so, guys, subscribe to the channel. Oh, I like the green. The green is pretty. You know, I never thought about mixing green and pink, but it looks good on the little pink dragon, so. Oh, thank you. <laughs> I might give that a shot sometime. Meh. Like us. Meh. Hey, you know what? He got no thumbs. Nope. No thumbs. So, you know, give him a thumbs up, because he sure can't do it himself. All right, you guys. And until the next time, I hope you wake up dancing, wake up dancing, boom, boom, wake up dancing every single day. Bye-bye.